Okay, guys. Today we're staying at <clears throat> Golden Gate, right on Fremont Street. <clears throat> and just usually I like to start off in the elevator and then walk to my room. So I'm going to do that this time. There's only one elevator, it's five floors, and there's one elevator. And it's a pretty small hotel, so that's probably no big deal. Hello so my room is 208 and I've already left the door open and this is my room 208 and it's a pretty pretty narrow narrow door but so anyway I come in a little bit older of an air conditioner system and uh, kind of a narrow entryway uh, so this is the bed nightstand other nightstand there's a little strip for your phone or whatever chair uh, TV stand thing there's a safe in here. I was hoping there would be like a refrigerator, but there's not. And let me show you my view real quick. And I opened these windows just to see if they would open, and they do. But uh, carrier, highlight them a little bit. Maybe they can they can fund me somehow since I'm showing their product so prominently in my video. Anyway, I guess if you want a little fresh air, there you go. But, uh, anyway, this is the room. Now, they got a little closet here. And by little, I mean that's very narrow door. Extremely narrow, but hey, it'll hold some clothes, I'm sure. Okay, and this bathroom's a little bit problematic for fat guys, okay, let me show you why, okay, so you open the door, okay, and it hits the toilet right there, so I don't know if I can, this is about the width of my elbow to my fingertips, Not very far, but for a fat guy, it's a little bit tight of a squeeze. And at least they've made the shower head go up. It has got a curved bar, which I like to see because I hate the shower curtain touching me when I'm standing in the tub. And uh, here we go. The So the door is hitting the toilet there. Some cool old hinges though. Uh -huh. Anyway, we're at Golden Gate. This is the room and that's what I got to say about that another thing to note is that the the deposit was a hundred bucks and they said it could stay on there for up to 30 days so I think that's a little bit lengthy of a time but they said usually it takes three to five days, but they release it upon checkout. And then they charge the resort fee. And then of course, I booked this one through Expedia. So I'm staying here tonight for probably 50 bucks. 
altogether, I think. Provided I get my deposit back, which I'm sure I will eventually. Life is good.